Hello, you're watching the Economic News on Insta TV channel. I'm Olga Vitkovskaya. Recently, the global economy has been suffering from the influence of such negative factors as the European debt crisis, stagnation in the USA and growth deceleration in China. Thus, in order to withstand the destructive impact of the aforementioned factors, the central banks mitigate the monetary policy. At least this was done by the European Central Bank and by the People's Bank of China. Now is the turn of the bank of Japan. The released on Monday Japanese statistical data give rise to such suppositions. Thus, the current account deficit in May declined by 62.6%, while the analysts predicted a decline by 13.6%. The number of machine orders, which is the main sector of the Japanese economy, declined as well by 14.8%, which is the maximal decrease of the industry for the last seven years. It was forecasted that the indicator should have edged down by 3.8 percent. The companies are narrowing the volumes of output amid slowdown of the Japanese economy, even despite the last meeting growth forecast increase by the Bank of Japan to 2 percent. Consequently, the Japanese GDP rise will appear the most significant among the G7 countries. Still, will the real economy answer the expectations of the Japanese government? On the one hand, amid global instability and the growing yen rate, all sectors of economy are suffering. On the other hand, the improved labor market and domestic demand indicators support the optimism. This is all about the latest economic events. Watch us on Insta TV. Goodbye.